Hello everybody and welcome back once again to the 8th annual vanilla level design contest. And I don't want this place. We did that last time and this is... Ugh. Going to check out... What appears to be the winner's world and municipal swimming. That does not sound like a great name for a good level, honestly, I'll be. Why is... Um, okay, interesting, I guess there's jet water under here, and wh why is, I'm, wow, good job, I am not entirely sure. Okay, let's, let's, I, I think, got, thank you, I think I see a, uh, pattern with the, uh, coins, I, no, no, no. Oh, I, th yeah, I saw a pattern with the coins, like, oh, these are the boundaries of the earth and things. Oh, no, we're going to work that work. Right, right. Great job, me. So apparently nothing over here. Why? Okay. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, that's probably a bad idea. I guess that worked out. I'm not entirely sure if, like, a municipal swimming thing is sort of like a town or whatever. It's like, oh, this is a swimming place for you. I'm not entirely sure you want your residents going into a uh, thing like this. Seems pretty deadly. I mean, unless you're trying to thin the population out a little bit. This time, I'm not to ignore the coins. I I will give this level that that was that's actually a pretty good thing to do there. And it comes down here. Ah, Did you go angled. Since when did? Angle like that. I don't know. This is not great. Fish. And I hear a football dude. Hammers. Underwater hammer dodging. Everybody's favorite, just so you know. I do like that there's that one up there. As well. That's that's nice. No game overs for you if you just grab this one up. Which isn't terribly difficult to do, and I don't know how I didn't get hit right there, but I'll take it. But when did the urchins do angles? I'm kind of curious if that's something that's actually per part of their AI programming, but was just never used in the original game. I could definitely see that. Um, there's... I don't remember if it's the viola or multi-viola, the orange or enemy that doesn't kill you in Norfair bounces off walls. Um, that thing, I think that's a multi-viola. It might just be a viola. It's one of those. The orange viola, we'll put it that way. Um, that thing 
basically you have a 360 degree well maybe not quite like that but basically that amount of um, angle with which to tell it to travel like it hits a wall it bounces off at this angle it starts off going off at this angle every wall it hits it's always doing this angle off of that that's just part of that thing's programming it's part of its AI so these urchins might have something like that I can't say for a certainty because I have no idea about this game It kind of looks like it has like multiple AI types. You've obviously got these things which just go across the line, which is what these angle guys do. Except they're doing it at an angle because they're weird. Um, you've got these kinds, which I think are just traveling in a straight direction. And maybe a third kind that kind of just travels along a solid surface? Okay, this is new. There's also a whistle guy. And a key. A mushroom. I'm gonna have to take this. Wait. Ah. Oh, okay. Let's not actually. Um. Um. I. Shut up, guy. Go away. Nobody actually likes that enemy. Comes urchin. Going down here, it seems. And oh, one up. Another one up. Okay. Does that mean this is going to be deadly? Or that's literally the. Level. So that was the secret exit. There's still a why is this thing? I don't even I guess that's why there's a mushroom? Oh, okay. I could also just die, that's always an option. Um... I'm guessing the other... exit... requires me to beat the snake. Why would you require a mushroom to pass that urchin? I don't know. Seems like you could not pass it. Not have a mushroom. Or. Oh my goodness. This is gonna be a disaster. Jump! Thank you. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> what is this? <laughs> um, this is going to be painful. Why would you do this? I 
also kind of wonder if there's just some sort of invisible trigger for uh, messages you can hit that'll pop the things up. Okay, got my shell. Did not keep my shell. Well, that worked. Um. Oh my goodness. Well, I might have a chance. Until that. That's the last Yoshi. Great job. It's just absolutely great job on that. I am a little bit confused by there not being fish in the way. By there not being a pipe by the I really need to not throw that thing so far there. <laughs> I could also do that. That's also an option. Oh my goodness, yes, message. We have heard your appeal. We are ignoring your appeal. They worked out way better than I thought it would. This is garbage, though. Maybe. Ha! And apparently, that was not the exit. Um. Um. That's not the exit. I beat the level though? Is it because there's no goal there or? <laughs> wow, that was great jump on my part. But that's just. Yeah, what? I don't know about that one. Ooh, we have Donkey Kong Country music. I approve of this. I am bad at Donkey Kong Country, but I still approve. Also, I'd like to point out, that background is actually really, really, really nice for a background. This mountain's coming up over water that's just all over the horizon. It's a nice visual effect. Also liking this level. Just in general, it's playing very well. I guess this is still a platformer, just without the uh, death pits. I mean, look, this is 
I mean, it might be a little more, I guess, complex visually than some of the other levels, but this is just like a standard, or at least what I would consider a pretty standard, just fun level? Unless something changes drastically back here, but... Like, why aren't all the contest entries basically this? I mean, the last one was different because it's a water world, but, or water level. So it's always going to be a little bit different. A little change of pace. And I'm running out of time. I mean, this is one of those levels where time is really tight. I see that. Is this the exit? This is the exit. Okay. Like that, right there. That should be every contest entry level. That's Fuzzball Frenzy. That's a good level. Abandoned mine. At least, again, this is just my opinion, but I really like the level. So I see gems and lights. Very interesting lights. And <laughs> good job, genius. Really, that's just brilliant. Let's die because somebody looked at me. That's I are good at this game. I am liking how this one is mine. Not mine shaped. That's all I can think of. My mine esque. Put it that way. Mine shaped, yes. It's very it's shaped very much like a mine because mines have a very specific shape. They crawl the hole. I like the sound of it. They became them. I Okay, so my favorite Zelda game is Majora's Mask. This really says don't worry. Um, one of my favorite parts of Majora's Mask is when they come to get the cows. That is basically the best thing ever in Majora's Mask. It's... <laughs> Why? Whatever. Those message blocks? About they and them? That kind of sounds a lot like, um, aliens coming to get cows. And I... I'm kind of excited about that, honestly. Is that? I'm not sure how you do that in this, but... Also, I approve of Skull and Ground. If you have a game like this, with tiles and stuff, and that game happens to have skulls in there that you can put in said tiles. You'd better put those skulls and tiles and use them. Because skulls and tiles are the best thing. this is from, but it's probably some RPG no one's ever heard of, but this is I 
get back. You know, the last level was really good. This level is also really good. At least to this point. Like, all the contest entries should have been like variations of that's a pipe. We should go in this. But, like, all the uh, bad levels should have just been variations of this? Like, just good platforming levels? Now this and the last one obviously have a bit more visual stuff going on with these lights. Uh, the background in the other one. And this one's actually got quite a bit of stuff going on. Even has fog going on. And... What's that? That is! Okay. There's, and there, red. There is a red glow in this room, and that is, unless there's something I am not thinking of, or I just jump in lava like an idiot, good job. Unless there's something I'm not thinking of, or it's just unused, I don't think that's very vanilla -y. Again, I don't know about this game. But that seems... I, I like it. But it seems very... Not vanilla? And if I don't run into the lava this time, I would... Not dead. Ah, stupid boo. Blarg. Okay. Good thing I had invincibility frames. These things are useful sometimes. I'm also glad I have this block to stand on. And I don't need to worry about the issue going because I died and lost all the others. So, whatever. I'm also seeing how these switches kind of help out. You don't need them, but you know, it's a safe platform if you did get them. I will go for this. Yeah. Absolute pro right there. Which just leads to a Yoshi coin. And looks like an exit from the mine. And it is! Look at that. And again, look at that background on there. Got the water and then the mountains in the background. These last two levels, like, I mean, they probably ranked higher just from how they look, but otherwise they're just solid levels, and the block in them, that actually sounds fun. But they're just solid levels, and more levels should be like that. There's two exits in this. I am still curious. What is going on with this level? Because there is another exit here that clearly I don't have. Also, yeah, good job spin jumping to fall down through it. Like, I thought for sure that didn't work. I thought for sure I would get the exit from beating the snake and doing that Yoshi coin thing, but apparently I was very wrong about that. Ah! Okay, whatever. 
and like okay i am exiting the level exit the level from the yoshi coin what in the world is going on with this one there is just there's nothing there i don't know about the level but I, I guess I'll just leave that exit for another time, maybe, but I think there should be an exit. But, um, it's, it's kind early, but I am going to go ahead and stop it here. Um, we ha had some really good levels and an interesting water level, even if the exit seems slightly broken. But in the next video, we'll pick it up with Throw Block Heaven, because that sounds amazing. And we shall see you for that.